It's feeling like Victory Tuesday for many people across the city as the Packers are giving back to the community in special ways. I'm your Green Bay Neighborhood reporter Andrew Amuzu and I'm at the Veterans Clinic, but this is just the first stop of many where you can find Packers players spreading holiday cheer. I just like putting smiles on people's faces, honestly. My first stop was at the Veterans Affairs Outpatient Clinic, where six Packers players came out to surprise local veterans, taking photos with fans and passing out treats. Let me know if you need any more. Offensive tackle Yash Nyman was one of the six players part of the surprise visit. I know it means a lot to them. I know growing up as a kid, seeing my favorite football players on TV was awesome, but actually getting to meet them is even better. It's just really neat that our, our Packers could have that time to do that with our people. Tim Dacey says the clinic and the Packers have partnered together for years. The Green Bay Packers Foundation was established in 1986 as a vehicle to assure continued contributions to charity. I traveled to Howie Elementary School next to see defensive tackle Kenny Clark hand out a different kind of vehicle while he was introducing a new program that teaches students how to ride a bike. This was in partnership with All Kids Bike. Being able to, to see these kids come out, you know, they, they all excited. They, they didn't care that I was here. They was like, we need to get to these bikes. My last stop was at Paul's Pantry, where rookie wide receiver Dontrevian Wicks helped celebrate Sargento's 21st season of touchdowns for hunger. You never know who, who might be struggling with hunger, and I'm glad that Sargento doing his part to feed the people in our community. And since 2002, the program has raised $1.8 million. And although this is my last stop for the day, the mission for community service doesn't end. Louis Gentine of Sargento Foods says that this should encourage the community to root for more touchdowns, but also give back any way you can. In Green Bay, Andrew Amuzu, NBC 26.